On World TB Day today, here's a story on how women who cannot conceive are being treated for TB even though they don't have the disease. Extremely sensitive tests like PCR tests catch latent bacteria in the body and based on that, women are being treated. Doctors are worried that this is building resistance to the drug and that could prove to be fatal since TB is among the biggest killers in the country. So, I had about six months ago, I thought that I couldn't conceive. तो फिर मुझे कंसल करना चाहिए तो मैंने उनसे कंसल किया डॉक्टर आभा से तो उन्होंने मुझे ये बताया कि इस आपको पहली बात तो टीवी नहीं है और दूसरी चीज आपको ये दवाई खाने से कोई फायदा नहीं होने वाला नुकसान नहीं होना है 27 years old and married for a year and a half Priyanka could not conceive the doctor prescribed her a full course of tuberculosis drugs citing that as a cause of infertility except that it was latent tuberculosis with no clinical symptoms. After a surgery to remove an ovary, tests detected the presence of the bacteria even though it was not an active infection. Positivity for PCR, it can go up to 50 to 60 percent. So when a laboratory, even good laboratory reports that PCR is positive in that person, it doesn't mean that PCR is truly positive. 50 percent of their patients where PCR test was done as positive, they were not truly having tuberculosis. Diagnosing tuberculosis based on PCR alone is risky. Nearly half of India's population has latent tuberculosis, which means they carry the bacteria but do not have the disease. By indiscriminately treating women who cannot conceive with anti-tuberculosis drugs, doctors are increasing the risk of drug resistance in future. So I feel that these young little girls are being treated unnecessarily for tuberculosis most of the times. If you don't have TB and you're taking one, these med medicines are extremely toxic. They have their effect on the liver, on the bone marrow, on the blood formation system. Out of 20,000 infertility cases that she treats every year, just about 10 actually have tuberculosis. But nearly one third were put on tuberculosis drugs unnecessarily. In New Delhi, Mohua Chaudhary for NDTV.